This is from the Discord for the Twitch Studio streaming app that I covered a, two years ago now. I think I covered it in 2019 when I was streaming uh, the, the what's the game called? Ion Fury. They have released for the Windows client only at the moment an in-game overlay which allows you to manage your live stream and the like while you're in-game. And at this point, classic, or well not classic, but you know, vanilla OBS Studio is the only... Uh, you know, game streaming app that's mainly game streaming focus that doesn't have an overlay. XSplit has it now with game. Well, it's Gamecaster now. Gamecaster has it. Uh, something else just introduced. Streamlabs OBS, I believe, has one. I could be mistaken, but I think they implemented something. If not, then OBS and Streamlabs OBS, OBS both need one. But I, I think it's time for OBS to implement an overlay. I, I personally don't find it super valuable. I think you're going to be. Uh, Primarily, I think you're going to have the best results while streaming with multiple monitors by, you know, streaming with multiple monitors. Even if you have a small one, something to have your chat, to have your stream controls, to have something else you want to reference while you're streaming up. I think that's forever going to be the best result. But for people who really can't do that, who are on laptops or who just can't do a second monitor and need an in-game overlay, uh... Uh, this could be for you. Twitch Studio is a great app that allows you to uh, stream to Twitch very simply without, uh, you know, without needing to know complex OBS stuff. And for those who's asking, yes, I use OBS Studio here for our streams and pretty much everything I do.